So a common question we get is, where will mangoes grow? Well, they're native to India and Southeast Asia, so they grow great in those areas. But it's been a hugely popular fruit for many, many centuries. And so, of course, people like travelers and traders have distributed seeds and young plants around the world. So mango trees really like sunshine and they don't want to freeze. So basically the prime mango growing areas of the world are between 30 degrees north latitude and 30 degrees south latitude. Mangoes like to grow between sea level and 1,600 feet. So mangoes are adaptable to a wide range of soils. Even in Palm Beach County, we have deep sandy soils in the eastern part of the county, and in the western part, it's you know, more damp soil and very rich in organic matter. Uh, you can grow mangoes in both areas. And that's true for other types of soil too. They, uh, mangoes do not like extremely alkaline soils or extremely acidic soils. But Another requirement for growing mangoes is to have cooler temperatures or drier weather. You can, of course, have cooler, drier weather. That's even better. But mango trees need a period of dormancy, which cooler temperatures or drier weather creates in order to flower and fruit. In some areas of the world that have like constant rainfall throughout the year, you get very big green mango trees, but very little fruit. Of course, this also depends on the variety of mango you grow because even varieties of mangoes have different requirements. But in general, cooler, drier winters are ideal. So mangoes are associated with a lot of islands around the world, the Caribbean islands and islands in the Pacific. Uh, and they can grow great in a lot of locations uh, that are very close to oceans and salt water but they don't want to grow near the shore. That location is best for coconut palms. <laughs> so we're about a mile from the Atlantic Ocean right here and when we have a strong uh, east or southeast wind and sometimes like a hurricane we get salt damage on the leaves here and our soils are really not that salty here, um, but as you get closer to the ocean, the salt in the soils and the salt that you get through the breezes and winds and or hurricanes uh, gets much more significant. So it gets to be very difficult to grow mango trees very close to the ocean. So islands around the world are able to grow mangoes but usually that is the inland portions of the islands and not real close to the beach. So here in Florida, we have been growing mangoes since the 1800s and they grow really well. We rarely get freezing temperatures and of course mangoes are adaptable to a wide range of soils, that, so that helps too. But mangoes also grow well in Southern Texas, in Arizona and Southern California. Now, a lot of people who live in other areas of the country would like to grow mangoes also. And there are some enthusiasts that have success growing uh, mangoes in areas that do not quite fit the requirements of mangoes. 
And so if you live in a marginal area like central Florida uh, in the Orlando area, of course, you can protect your plant by putting a tarp or a tent over it and a heater on the ground when you have some freezing temperatures. Uh, for other areas of the country where your freezes get to be weeks long for, in some cases, uh, a good strategy is to plant a tree in a container that you can move inside during the periods of freezing temperatures. Of course, it's great to have a greenhouse and you know have the whole greenhouse protected, but uh, basically if you live too far north and your tree has to be inside for too long, grow lights can help a lot. So wherever you are, good luck in growing mango trees.